Okay, what we're going to do is we're going to go in straight away and add a new image layer. And with this, I've got these set up for you. First one I'm going to take is a white signature on a black background. I'm going to click open. Once that drops in place, I'm going to go into the three dots here, go into image mapping and go fit. That will take it to the aspect ratio the image was created at. Then from there, layer transform and uncheck the padlock first and then check it again. Sometimes it retains the information from the last time you clicked a padlock. Scale it down in size. Place it wherever you want it in the screen. Click done. Then go into your layer blends and choose the layer blend that works for it. I find screen for the black and white seems to work best. Okay, for the next one, we're going to add a new image layer. And we're going to take the white background with the black text. Click open and again go into the three dots, image mapping, fit. And we've got this signature here. Once again go into layer transform and if the padlock's checked, uncheck it and then lock it again and then scale it. And move that to wherever you want within your screen. I'll just place that there. Click done. Then for this blend, multiply. You can hardly see that there, but at least you see how it's worked. Multiply seems to work best for the white and black. Last but not least, let's put a watermark in. Add new image layer. And let's go for YouTube signature black and white. Open. Again, this will drop in in place. And again, go into the three dots. Image mapping. Fit. Layer transform. I'm just going to scale this down a little bit. Uncheck and check. And then scale. If you forget to do that, you'll see what happens. I'm going to leave that there. I'm going to click done. Then I'm going to go into the blends. Multiply, darken, color burn, lighten, screen, overlay. Use whatever one you wish. I'm going to leave that there. Create it as a watermark. I'm going to pull it right back to there. And that's it. Three different ways of creating a watermark.